in Romans chapter 8, verse 28, the Bible says, And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are called according to his purpose. In Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 12, the Bible says, The Lord shall open unto thee his good treasure, the heaven to give the rain unto thy land in a season, and to bless all the work of thy hand. And thou shalt lend unto many nations, and thou shalt not borrow. May you not borrow in Jesus' name. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, O oh Lord, help me to pay my house rent in the name of Jesus. O oh Lord, help me to pay my house rent in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV, a TV station dedicated for dreams and warfare prayers. Today's topic is prayer for money to pay house rent. As your landlord issued a quick notice to you, are you struggling to pay your house rent? As your house agent giving you some time to fulfill your house rent, but you're unable to fulfill that house rent, maybe you notice that you have been fired from work or your business is not growing or you find out that your organization has not paid you for quite some month back. Worry no more. The great supplier of prosperity will assign a big favor to you. Don't give up. That house rent shall be paid in the name of Jesus Christ. Payment of house rent, payment of rent money it's a struggle for many people these days. Every year, many are always struggling to pay house rent. Praying for house rent money is a way of telling God to intervene concerning your house bill. There's nothing that is too difficult for God to do. At a point of praying, God might send someone to help you or connect you to a big opportunity. He might also fasten your organization. To pay, you, to pay you your income or salary. Many people are facing house bill problems. Every year, their house bills keeps piling up because there's no enough money or no money to proceed with the payment of their house rent. Life becomes so hard and difficult for this set of people, especially a person with family. It becomes more challenging when the house owner gives a deadline to pay or pack away from the rented apartment. Some people have never encountered the problem of paying their house rent until they find themselves in a house whose foundation is weak to have swallowed the prosperity and virtues of their occupants. That is why we need to pay. That is why we need to pray against any spirit of foundational strongman that is attacking the source of our finances at the edge or paying for our house rent. Perhaps you have many house bills to pay, like telephone bills, health bills, water system bills, internet service bills, child care bills, and all that. As a child of God, you don't have to commit suicide or venture into any type of front-led businesses. The Holy Spirit, who gave you the ability to provide this basic amenity, amenities, will surely give you the grace to pay them. When you pray this prayer, three things will happen to you. Number one, the Lord will supply his needs to you, according to Philippians chapter 4, verse 13. Number two, the favor of the Lord will come upon you and prosper you, as taken from the book of Psalm, chapter 90, verse 17. Number three, the Lord will speak to your landlord or the government officials to give you more time to gather yourself better for his big blessings coming. As taken from the book of Isaiah, chapter 41, verse 10. By the grace of God, we are having three prayer sections. I want you to prepare yourself. If you are having difficulties in paying your house rent, you discover that in your place of work, you have not been paid, no income, no money is coming right now. Everywhere is blocked. These prayers are very, very powerful. It will facilitate favor for you and it will, give, it will open doors for bigger opportunities for you in Jesus' name. The instruction is to embark on seven days fasting and prayers between 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Take any money with you and use it as a point of contact for your financial breakthrough. Stand upon the word of God in Psalm 20 verse 4, Psalm 23 verse 1, and Psalm 92 verse 12 to 15. 
prayer section one our confession bible verse is taken from the book of philippians chapter 4 verse 19 supported with praise and worship for five minutes prayer point number one close your eyes take this prayer point loud and clear say holy spirit use people to bless me financially so that i will settle my rent this month in the name of jesus holy spirit use people to bless me financially so that i will pay my house rent this month in the name of jesus in the name of jesus holy spirit use people to bless me to favor me so that i can pay i can fulfill my house rent this month in the name of jesus in jesus name we pray amen prayer point number two i want to take this prayer point say father let those that promise to help me financially be able to fulfill it this month in the name of jesus say father let those that promise to help me financially be able to fulfill it in the name of jesus father let those that promised to help me financially be able to fulfill it fulfill it fulfill it mention their names those that have promised to help you mention their names let god begin to disturb them let god begin to disturb their minds so that they can fulfill what they have promised for you in the name of jesus in jesus name we pray amen prayer point number three shout this prayer point loud and clear say every power attacking the source of my income you are a liar fall down and die fall down and die fall down and die every power attacking the source of my income you are a liar fall down and die 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 in the name of jesus your time is up you evil hands upon my finances upon my work upon my career fall down and die remove your hands and wither in the name of jesus in jesus name we pray amen prayer point number four prayer point number four i want you to raise your your two hands up to the heavens say divine prosperity enter my life and cause me to pay my rent in the name of jesus divine prosperity enter my life and cause me to pay my house rent in the name of jesus divine prosperity enter my life and cause me to pay my house rent and cause me to pay my house rent and cause me to pay my house rent in the name of jesus in the name of jesus divine prosperity enter my life enter my hand and cause me to pay my house rent this month in the name of jesus in jesus name we pray amen prayer point number five i want you to take this prayer point loud and clear play if you are a man place your right hand dip your right hand into your pocket dip your right hand into your pocket and take this prayer point loud and clear for three minutes say father i am tired of managing poverty give me the sources that will cancel every insult in my life in the name of jesus say father i am tired of managing poverty Give me the sources that will cancel every insult in my life in the name of Jesus. Father, I am tired of managing poverty. Give me the sources that will cancel every insult in my life, in my family, in my household, in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number six. Take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, any power that wants me to have problems in paying my house rent. Ah, Baba, you are a liar. I command you to die. I command you to die. Any power that wants me to have problems in paying my house rent, you are a liar. Da, 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 da. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number seven. Take this last prayer point loud and clear. Say, blood of Jesus, change the mind of my landlord against me. In the name of Jesus. Pray that prayer point up very well. You, that brother, you need to pray that prayer point. You are having challenge with your landlord. Your landlord is planning to issue you a quick notice. Especially, and you, that woman, your landlord, your landlady, your, your, your caretaker is planning to issue you a quick notice. If you can pray this prayer very well, the Lord will do something great. Say, blood of Jesus, change the mind of my landlord. Change the mind of my landlady. Change the mind of my caretaker against me. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I pray for you today. You are having challenges in paying your house rent, in paying your telephone bills, in paying any kinds of bills. Today, I pray the Lord will pay all your debts in the name of Jesus. And you shall be free. And there shall be financial freedom in your life. You shall not be disgraced. You shall not be in sh- the, Your enemies shall not put you in shame in the name of Jesus. As you pack into that house, 
in blessing. You shall not pack out in shame in Jesus' name. Quickly, we are going to pray as your two. Our conventional Bible verse is taken from the book of Matthew chapter 6, verse 33. It's on the screen. Supported with praise and worship for five minutes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. And take the following prayer point loud and clear. Prayer point number one. If I were you, I would bring out my money. Any money as a point of contact. Say, oh Lord, my house rent has expired. If your house rent has expired, take this prayer point. Oh Lord, my house rent has expired. Arise and intervene in my life speedily in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, my house rent has expired. Or my house rent is about to expire. Arise, oh Lord, and intervene in my life speedily. 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 In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number two. I want you to take this prayer point loud and clear. Say, any person that is making life difficult for me in this house, oh God, arise and fight them. In the name of Jesus, any person that is making life difficult for me in this house, oh God, arise, fight them, 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 fight them. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number three. I want you to take this prayer point loud and clear. Raise your money up to the heavens. Raise your money up to the heavens and say this prayer point. Say, Oh Lord, I need money to pay my rent. Arise and surprise me this month in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, I need money to pay my rent. Arise and surprise me. Arise and surprise me. Arise and surprise me this month. Arise and surprise me this month in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number four. Say, my father, I know this is not your plan for my life. By your mercy, arise and pay all my debt this year. In the name of Jesus. Say, my father, I know this is not your plan for my life. By your mercy, arise and pay all my debts this year. Pay all my debts this year. Pay all my debts this year. Pay all my debts this, debt this year. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number five. Tell this prayer point loud and clear for four minutes. Say, all the plans and expectations of my enemies to disgrace me in this house shall be cut off in the name of Jesus. All the plans and expectations of my enemies to disgrace me in this house shall be cut off in the name of Jesus. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number six. Say, Father, I am the breadwinner of my family. By your mercy, arise and let there be financial favor in my life. In the name of Jesus. Say, Father, I am the breadwinner of my family. By your mercy, arise and let there be financial breakthrough in my life. Let there be financial breakthrough in my life. Let there be financial breakthrough in my family. Father, bless the work of my hands. Let there be financial breakthrough in my life. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number seven. Take this last prayer point loud and clear. Shout it loud and clear. Say, Oh Lord, as I make plans to pay my rent, I decree. By your mercy, O Lord, my family shall not feed from hand to mouth. In the name of Jesus, O Lord, as I make plans to pay my house rent, I decree by your mercy, O Lord, my family shall not feed from hand to mouth. In the name of Jesus, my family shall not feed from hand to mouth. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Brethren across the world, I know there's a breakthrough coming right now for that man, for that woman right now. This week, there's going to be somebody that will pay, you, that will favor you. There's going to be financial recovery. There's going to be financial breakthrough in your life, and you shall be and you shall pay your house rent, any type of bills that have been piled up. The Lord will pay those debts in the name of Jesus Christ. So we are going to prayer section three. Our confession Bible verse is taken from the book of Third John, chapter one, verse two. It's on the screen. Supported. With praise and worship for five minutes. I want you to take this prayer point loud and clear. Place your two hands to your head. Lay your two hands on your head and say this prayer point loud and clear. Say, You strong man in this house, making it hard for me to prosper. Your time is up. Fall down and die. 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 
you strong man in this house, making it hard for me to prosper. Your time is up. Fall down and die. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number two. Shout this prayer point loud and clear. Say, Oh Lord, arise and disgrace every power that is disgracing tenant in this house. In the name of Jesus. Say, Oh Lord, arise and disgrace every power that is disgracing tenants in this house. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, arise and disgrace every power that is disgracing tenants in this house. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number three. Shout this prayer point for four minutes. Say, any wicked spirit that has caused my ability to pay my house rent, you are a liar. Be dismantled in the name of Jesus. Any wicked spirit that has caused my ability to pay my house rent, you are a liar. Be dismantled. Be dismantled. Be dismantled by the blood of Jesus. Be dismantled by the blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number four. Prayer point number four. Lay your right hand upon your mornings. And take this prayer upon land and clear. Or lay your hand upon your bank account. Your bank account number. Lay your hand upon it. Shout this prayer point with understanding. Say, so let the resurrection power of God revive every dead finances in my life. In the name of Jesus. Let the resurrection, resurrection power of God revive every dead finances in my life. In my destiny. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number five. Prayer point number five. I want to mention the name of people that has promised to help you. In this prayer point number five. Say, oh Lord, always remember and favor me and my family in this house. Oh Lord, always remember and favor me and my family in this house. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, always remember and favor me and my family in this house. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number six. Prayer point number six. I want you to bring out water. Bring out water. Bring out water. Please dip your two hands into that water. Bring out a water or a bowl of water. Dip your two hands into that water. Something will happen. Especially for that man. You have been facing financial difficulties. Now, breakthrough will come. Say this prayer point loud and clear. Say, Father, bless the work of my hands. Promote and enlarge me in all areas of my life. In the name of Jesus. Say, Father, bless the work of my hands. Promote and enlarge me in all areas of my life. In the name of Jesus. Let your hands be deep in that water. Say, Father, bless the work of my hands. Promote and enlarge me in all areas of my life. In the name of Jesus. Pray this prayer point for three minutes. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Prayer point number seven. Take this last prayer point loud and clear. You strong man of poverty that has become a giant in my life. Say, you strong man of poverty that has become a giant in my life. I pull you down in the name of Jesus. I pull you down in the name of Jesus. You strong man of poverty that has become a giant in my life. I pull you down. 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 In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. I pray the Lord will pull down that strong man in your life that strong man of poverty, that strong man of losses, that strong man of suffering and hardship, that strong man of financial debt. I pray there shall be favor, good news shall spring forth for you and you shall pay that out strength to the glory of God and to the shame of the devil. If you are blessed by this broadcast, share it to your friends, your family, your relatives and everyone for, for, for this broadcast to bless them. If you are not yet subscribed, subscribe today. Once again, this is Evangelist Joshua from Lagos. Mm-hmm.